Hi, Chapman. Hey, welcome to Hamiltonville Farm. We just got a brand new t-shirt design. It's a baseball look. Ah, oh, really wind? Anyway, it's like a baseball logo tee. So you can check that out. The merch is in the description below. I don't know. I kind of like it. Hey, we're at a log loader. We ain't done a knuckle boom log loader in a long time, have we? Uh, I don't, I think it's been a little while. This one's a cool one, though. It's got Detroit in it. Yeah, 0160. Yeah. Hank, I had a, reminds me of a story I had a friend one time. He was a logger, had that right there and an old skidder. He was a rough character, cussed all the time. Yeah. Had a heart attack right on the ramp and died. Oh, no. Nice. He wouldn't help. <laughs> and the devil met him down there and okay. said, hey, listen, uh, we don't have room for you right now. I said, what? I said, yeah, we're going to have to send you back up for 90 days. Yeah. And then you come back down. He said, well, what am I supposed to do? The devil said, I don't care what you do. He said, I always wanted a log big in a big way. All this junk I ran in has put me right here. Yeah. I don't care. Go ahead. So, man, he went back up there and he had two brand new John Deere skidders, a new loader, Ooh, five new Peterbilt trucks, trailers had to work. And they were logging about 30 days later. The devil showed up on his ramp. Yeah. And the, he said, wait a minute, you said I had 90 days? Yeah. He said, no. He said, we're going to terminate this. There's not enough money in hell to run an operation like this. <laughs> you bankrupted me, dog. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. Yeah, that's right. Listen, we're going to make this one happen, though, ain't we? I was waiting for you to do your pruning skills right there. Well, I did bring a pruner uh, somewhere. This is probably, I don't know, I'm going to say somewhere in the late 70s, early 80s loader. I uh, even brought a, uh, a stepladder just for you because I knew we was coming out here. Yeah. Where, did, I, did I not bring them? I thought I threw them in the truck this morning. Well, I mean, it's man, just Oh, there going. they are. Yeah. yeah. So my electric chainsaw, my electric chainsaw's broke. I don't know, what's, I don't know what the deal is with it. So. Did you try charging the battery? <laughs> I did. <laughs> it's crazy thing. We talked about money this morning. With you know, I actually went to the ATM the other day. It's There's, not a competition. I'm hey. just telling you. Just, a I saw one legged dude. I saw one legged dude at the ATM. It was the craziest thing. I never seen that before. I asked him what he was doing. He said he was checking his balance. <laughs> <laughs> oh, was man. it our buddy? <laughs> Pig. Huh? Pig. Drew. Yeah. Would you see Drew at the local bank? Yeah. We gotta cut our way through like a old school. How we gonna get enough? I'm glad it's cold out so the snakes ain't out here. Do what now? I say I'm glad it's cold so the snakes ain't yeah, out here. Yeah, snakes and the walls. Actually warming up the tick today. Well, the good thing is you can get up there and you can see if everything's on the engine <laughs> before we go further. You probably stand right there and. Here's your old man heifer if you need it. Alright, let me. Thank you. Ugh. I wonder how long this has been sitting here. I'll smell the fuel here in a minute, but yeah. Okay. I was smelling something, but it wasn't fuel. Ah, <laughs> uh, get off there. I don't know if that's going to work or not. This right here, you could actually put this on a genre of, you know, landscaping. You get a wheel at start and a landscaping. I'm like, why is this not cra That's a metal wire. It's a cable. I'm like, it ain't cutting. Because there's cable. You ain't had that Wi Fi up there? <laughs> <laughs> I 
be so funny if somebody got out of the cab and said, hey. What are you doing? I was just watching Hamiltonville Farm trying to start something. Isn't that amazing? Crazy, isn't it? What do I got in my pocket? Oh, my truck key. It's amazing. It's been a long time since we did a Detroit too. But well, we, we pretty much are Detroit whispers. I don't know, but I only think one Detroit's ever whooped us. Which one? Um, in Fort Lauderdale. Well, <laughs> that's the exact same engine that was in that one in Fort Lauderdale. Oh, yeah? Yeah. That's awesome. But the good thing is, it, the air intake is turned out, but the muffler looks like it uh, may have given up years past. I'm going to climb up this thing. You know how they dent the stuff like those guards where you are in front of the radiator protector? You know how that gets bent? Yeah. Did oh, how does it get bent? Yeah. Do I know how? Yeah, yeah. probably. Hitting on other, uh, uh, like other, oh, literally, dude. I just cut the alternator. <laughs> I just cut the alternator wiring. <laughs> That's mm. awesome. What they do, they stack up wood and they get it too close to it and when they swing, they swing into it sometimes. Yeah. I done that when I first started learning how to run a knuckle bone. Until your daddy said, hey, don't do that. Oh, he said more than that. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't do it one time. That's right. He knew I was just learning, but it was kind of like hold my flashlight moment. Yeah, yeah. Well, I sure enough clean cut it, well, but thing, I'm not sure we're going to... This thing come from uh, Night Forestry. Night They're forestry. still in business. Are they? Yeah. They was in Thomasville at the time. Now they, they sold out to Tidewater. Now they're in uh, Wiggum. Wiggum, what a name, huh? That's between Thomasville and uh, Bainbridge. On 84. And they're Barco dealers still. If you guys have run Barcos, let us know in the comments. Give us some stories about you running some Barcos. There's no telling, because this right here, they sold out in the 80s, so this right here is going to be an old one. I mean, you can tell by looking at it. Oh. All right, let me see if it, let me see if it fan spins. Well, it's a clutch. Huh? It's a clutch fan, I guess. Well, it shouldn't be. Uh, well, it's just spinning on the, the belts don't look bad at all. I didn't know. Well, I guess it is. Yeah. Check the oil right there, Hank. Is it right there on, on this side? No, it's going to be on the inside. It ain't going to be on that side. Yeah, the exhaust is turned down. Is there a ladder on the other side? I don't know. It is. Well, you're going to... Let me throw my... I'm not sure I can get up here. I mean, it's been a long time is what I'm telling you. Hang on here. I don't know if you got anything to grab there or not. Ugh. I'm not having to cut your way through this thing. Ugh. Hopefully I don't fall through the rest of the sheet metal here. Huh? 
What happened? What happened was, watch yourself, I'm just going to start chunking vegetation down at you. Well, just stand by a minute there, driver. Where's your clippers? That's water? cable. Yeah, that's that same cable I was trying to cut. Grab mm. that cable and I'll pull the weeds off of it. Maybe <laughs> not. You grab it. It's got a bolt on the end of it. You do it. What's that bolt go to, I wonder? Well, that's going to be a... A throttle cable? That's going to be something. Does this trailer have wheels on the front as well? That I don't know. I mean, I see an axle under it, but I didn't know. Well, yeah, that. it could. Okay, it does. Interesting. Well, it's probably self-propelled then. Really? It could be. Does but that now they don't need to self-propel just because it's got a huh? Does that mean it's got an engine up front? No, it runs off. They if it has it, it would run off the hydraulics of the knuckle bar. And negative Ghost Rider. They just got that on the front just to keep it down. Oh, okay. <laughs> Pretty neat. We get this thing running the way. We're gonna be somebody. The swing, swing pedals over here. I didn't even look to see if there's wasps in this, but there ain't. Not that it matters, but. <clears throat> Did you ever heard of Pettibone? Oh yeah, they make like telehandlers and stuff. Pettibone made Barco at one time, really? owned them. They went bankrupt and they uh, <laughs> wanted to keep Barco, but they couldn't and so they sold Barco off, story I heard. But Pettibone did used to make these. Used to, you could see you could see the emblem Pettibone out here on the booms. Oh boy! I'm telling you, a big man can't fit up. Wouldn't been able to fit up here. Why? Cause this is. I'm talking about right up on the controls. I think I think this thing may have had a. Is that this center lever there? That could have been the up, forward, and back, but you'd had to steer it. Yeah. It may have had a control at one time, and they just took it off. Interesting. I'm trying to read this. Uh... But they could have had one of the outrigger cylinders. Let me put my eyeglasses on here. That's cab information. This, this, uh... The information for the loaders right here. You're gonna have to clean it off, but it's right here. There's a serial number right there. Eleven four eighty seven. Oh, that's an old one. Eleven four sixty seven. I don't know if he's had the data manufacturers on them or not, but they probably did. We get a rag to clean that off real good. Yeah. We found some pertinent information here. <laughs> oh, Lord. <clears throat> All right, let me I think on the governor box right there, the aluminum thing on the back of the engine, mm -hmm. it usually has a data manufacturer on it. Oh, there is a To your left? Yeah. You see it? Uh-huh. Touch see. it with your hand. Yeah. See if you can see. Don't don't ever question me like that again. Yeah. I... 
it is a Any guesses? I'm gonna say 78. You're way off. 84. 84, okay. 1984. There was a time when she was mine in 1984. I knew it'd be late 70s or early 80s. That was nasty. Where's the dip stick at? Should be right there. Should be able to check it from some strange reason, I thought you checked it from that other side over there. I think you there. might be right. You know? Because I sure enough ain't seen it. I mean, it's a Detroit. You just didn't really have to check it. There's no <laughs> need. You knew it was low. Yeah. Well, you just got you some oil and added it. Yeah. Look at those screens. Can space. you see the exhaust? Is that it right that's good. It's 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 covered. This yeah. thing might not have water in it. It's gonna fire up, man. What you talking about, driver? I tell you what. What I'm gonna give you a reason why it might not fire up. Cause it ain't got a starter. Uh, no. I mean, yes, yeah, got a starter, but there's just the wire. Every wire is nicked and cut and bruised, and you don't have to worry about that, Hank. Okay, good. Nothing about this. Is electronic. Is electronic. Okay. As well, I gotta find a dipstick. I don't see it over here. Well, I see it. <laughs> <laughs> I know you do. That thro that uh, the governor ain't stuck. If ever, ever oh, like that's good. Yeah, see that. This was holding the governor down. It looks like. What we're gonna do to prevent it from running away? You reckon? Yeah. What's the cutoff plan? Well, you just was controlling the cutoff there. But now we can have that uh, intake over there where we could put something on it. It's got a blower on the other side. Okay. And we can have something ready for that. Well, we need to check the oil. Yeah, let me get up here. Huh? Sir? Let me get up here. Boy, this thing has been a while. Look at them hoses. Mm hmm. Be careful. Man. I don't think they, uh, no, I don't want to be careful. <laughs> I, don't, I want to fall on this. Well, if I could say, get your hands off me. <laughs> Jeez. Did you check the water? No, sir. It's green. Is it green? No. Leave there. Dang, I'm starting It's up. cold outside, ain't it? Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, no water up here. Yeah, that's shocking, isn't it? Uh -huh. Let's see. Maybe this will hold. Yeah, be careful. I'll try Roof to... collapse. You just don't step back because I'm on the ground. <laughs> Just like Wiley, always laying laying down on the job. I don't look too awful bad. That's where you pour the oil in. The oil stick's got to be right here somewhere. I can't see what y'all are seeing, so hopefully I'm getting y'all a good shot. There it is right there. Alright, we can get it from the ground. No, yeah. no that's it. You're yeah. right. That's it. Alright, we can get that from the step. Well, why didn't you see it when you was up there the first time? <laughs> yeah. Is my arm a little longer than yours? <laughs> <laughs> well, you can get back down there because you got to tote batteries up here. Because <laughs> I'm not coming back down <laughs> since I'm here. <laughs> ow, ow. Hey, what's that right there, Hank? <laughs> <laughs> it's shiny because I just rubbed it off. Hey -oh. Alright, let me go get some batteries. Alright. Check the oil. Careful. Won't take but one battery. One battery? One battery. Nice.
And I got a brand new one. I'm talking about brands. There's the throttle there. Did you try it? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. It's got to be. I, I wonder how long this thing's been set. Huh? I wonder how long. That bungee. That bungee was still holding tension on it. Right. Let me check the Earl. I'm gonna get my I'm gonna get my steps in today. Ugh. I feel like one of them competitions where they do the log rolling. Yeah. <laughs> <coughs> oh Wiley. This uh -oh. thing's making all. No water? No, sir. That's a plus. Yep, that's in good shape. Okay. This thing gonna fire right up, man. You what didn't check about? the fuel up here or nothing, Hank. No, I didn't check the fuel. Fuel cap's loose. They might have been up here siphoning it. Oh, my goodness. This thing's got fuel in it. You'll see that. My only concern, Wiley, is when we get this thing fired up, it's not going to charge because I cut these wires. <laughs> my, my only concern is how many, how long the viewers are going to listen to this. I wonder if they done scrub through this part anyway. Hey, if you made it this far into the video. Throw a wrench emoji in the comment section right here. That'd be pretty cool. Let's see if we can't put a bunch of wrenches in the comment section. So, should we take this intake off right here and, and just be prepped to throw a block over it? We can. It, I mean, we've never actually done that before, but I did have one run away with me the other day, so. Yeah. It made me aware yeah. of how it can happen. Um, okay. Let me go get your, let me go get your battery. Okay. Ugh. That's a long way down there for an old man. Brand new. Look at that. Bought it last night. I had to buy it last night because my wife's battery went dead on her truck. I was like, man, you kidding me? So we'll take these up. Wiley, well, I got a pretty disturbing phone call last night. I got a buddy of mine that was in an accident and he was, he cut off three of his fingers on his right hand on a, and it was a, in a saw, a band saw. And he went to the doctor and doctor, he, saw, he told the doctor, he was like, the doctor's like, you're going to lose these three fingers. And he said, will I ever be able to write with my hand again? And he goes, possibly, but I wouldn't count on it. That, that, was, that was almost funny. <laughs> My cameraman laughed. Well, it don't take much for him, Hank. That's right. He's not seasoned just yet. <laughs> no, he just... And he's trying to get a pay raise. That's right. His, his, his check cleared, so he's good. Yeah. Y'all keep watching so I can pay... So I can pay Wiley and my cameraman. All right, here you go, boss. You can't get it up no higher than that. <laughs> <laughs> no, but you can throw dirt all in there. I appreciate that. I do need a, a stick to check this fuel, a ch fuel checker. I can see it, but I just like to know. Hey, you know what? We might use this cable, Hank, that was left here. Nah. Careful, it's fra fragile. Oh, yeah. Look at there. That's it's red, right. ain't it? Yes, sir. Got the cherry flavor. Well, how long has it been? Go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> you, know, you know what we should do? What should we, we should do? bring one of those uh, torches and see if it will burn when we check it. This smells like varnish. What? It smells like varnish. Well, it'll fire then. <laughs> <laughs> That's literally, I, I bet it's been 25 years. Actually, it had to be longer. 
I bet it's been 40 years, Wiley. No, let's see. It's a daggum 84, yeah, so 40 84, years. It, it just is 40 years old. They run it more than a day. Yeah. Uh, let's see. So thir I bet it's been 30 years. You know why? No. Nope. You don't think so? No. You think it's been 20? Yeah. No. Let me tell you why. Let why? me tell you why, Wiley. Why? Because he said that loader had been 20 years. So you think this was still running when that loader shut off? No, I'm Probably saying? not. So I bet, I, we're going to say 25 years. I bet it's been 25 Probably years. Probably so. Probably. So, hey, we give him 29, 25. I mean, it's, uh, who's going to fact check us? <laughs> fact checkers are never right anyway. Oh, man. Oh, I need to get, might as well get this bag. Hey, did I tell you guys already that we got 71 applicants for our scholarship? That's awesome. We're going to pick the winner in May, May, June time frame. I know, the, I know the date, but I just can't remember. It's in May or June. It's on the website. It's on the bold.org website for the scholarship. And then Scanner Danner is helping us out. You know what's strange about that is? What's out of the that? 71 applicants. What's that? That's just about half of the viewers. <laughs> <laughs> so that tells you that the viewers are ambitious that watch this channel. That's right. They're trying to make trying to it make starts it great again. I know you guys, uh, I know you guys are watching this. But it's a, uh, my analytics, my data tells me that you guys watch about 2.8 videos of ours a month. We drop six to eight videos a month. So once you're done with this one, watch 20, 30 minutes of another one. And another guy had mentioned that he's like, man, I can't watch an hour long. I wish you'd made them shorter. Well, you don't have to watch it all in one sitting. You know, watch what you can and then come back later on, use the bathroom, whatever it is that you do, and then finish it up, or go to the next one and watch another one from us. That's, that would help us out a lot. What else do I need to get while I'm down here? I don't know, hopefully I'll think of something when you get oh, here. I'm gonna get, uh, I'm gonna take this, uh, I'm gonna take this hose clamp off and try to take this off while you're doing that. Cause uh, it would be bad for us to, have his name run away. There's a puppy. Hey, pups. How you doing, buddy? Hey. What you doing? What's your name? Huh? Pudding Tang, you ask me again, I'll tell you the same. You're a pretty dog. Yes, you are. Mm. Mm. Oh, I gotta do something. Let's try. Take this off here. I need that step. I wonder if I can put that right over here. It's, it's getting challenging. Keep getting up and down on this barrel. Let's see if that'll hold me. size it is. Oops. So Uncle Wiley, what do you think about this as being a, do you think that this was a like entry level machine or do you think log and crews liked them and used no, them. No, this was, this was the thing back there in the day. I mean, they made bigger loaders, stronger loaders, but most of the time, 
they used, this this was the progression they still they made the 160s up till uh, 2000s really interesting and then they just changed model numbers you know it's yeah that's right bigger faster stronger yeah Cab operator friendly and stuff like yeah, that. Yeah, right on. So this machine right here goes for price, price of scrap. Do what now? Would this machine go for the price of scrap? Now? Yeah. That's all it's worth. I mean, if somebody's hunting, if this Detroit runs good, it would be worth just a little more than scrap, but everything else is useless. Yeah. Just need to melt it down and make another one out of it. Kind of like you on our Willis Start videos. That's exactly right. <sighs> Did you hear that? Listen. You listening? Yeah. Sounds like a trip to the starter man. Because <laughs> <laughs> it's not hidden. Yeah. I can't get on the back side. There we go. See the little starter button here? That's what I, I'm just hoping it'll. Darn. Oh, I can't do anything left handed. Oh, uh, let's see, Hank. I might try to get laid down on this top again and see if I can get this off here. I got it loose, I just can't get it off. Okay. We'll just kind of leave it there till we find out what we're going to do here so no water will go in it. Because if we can't get it, we got to do something about getting it to spin. I mean, we can take it off and go through the motions of this is what happens if it runs away. <laughs> uh. <clears throat> Hank, do you see... The little on the end of it. Got to have something maybe to spin it. it. I mean, it's just not hit. Maybe a hammer. Are you... Okay. We was yeah. on a good thing about starters for a little while. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to tell you what, though. I think my wife commandeered my hammer well just a, a big bar or something uh, you know i'd rather have a big hey hank i'd rather have a, a a bar that i can hit that you can what that a bar uh. Is this too big? Mm -mm. Something on Whoop, 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 whoop.
had a sawmill and can't find a piece of wood. Not doing any good. Sir? Not doing any good that way. Let me get down and come out of the way and see if you short it out and get the get the starter engine to turn. My plans was not to come down. <laughs> I know. <laughs> yeah. We can even cut it. You need the ladder over there? No. When did you kill the deer this year, sir? Have you killed you any deer this year? No, dude. I've seen one big doe, and that's it. I saw. I did see nine hogs last time I saw it. But I told you we're not all hogs, honey. <laughs> we're sensitive. You want this ladder? No, I'm gonna try to. We'll have to get under it to get to the starter. I know how you I know how you old people, your grandparents are. I have been feeling my age, honestly. Dude, it's so funny because we, we went and visited my grandma last weekend and she's got one of those stair lifts that you go up the steps with. And I said, Grandma, I said, I'll give you twenty dollars if you let me ride that stair lift. And she was like, I don't know, but I think she's gonna take me up on it. Oh boy. <laughs> Please don't unsubscribe. <laughs> I, I think you can overdo them sometimes, Hank. I mean, just to continue. Just the continuous flow yeah. of bad jokes. You know, it's kind of like what y'all did to the the racky, the elite racky, what were they called? <laughs> yeah, the elite guard. Yeah, just kept on bombing and bombing them. <laughs> he did lay it on. He swing a lot of lead down there. Then they, uh, then they said, you know what? No more. Yeah, I'm getting old. Yeah, hard on my knees, ain't it? <coughs> I hate getting old. All but the alternative is <laughs> worse. I think I need to lose about 35 pounds and yeah, the old good. body wouldn't be. It does all good, I think. All right, Hank. <laughs> <laughs> Where's the steps? <laughs> Your ladder, sire. Started be easy enough to take off. Beat and bang it, throw some PP blaster in it, and put it back on. You think we could access it better if we took off the oil pan? <laughs> God knows. Let's uh, hand me something to short out with and see if I can make the starter motor turn. Ten four.
You know, we don't have the master key anymore. You know why? So we'll have to get a new one. Uh, because I've got, I've got it on my telehandler. If you haven't seen that telehandler project, check it out. We got it, we got it from not running to working. Uh, so it's a pretty cool series. I'm hoping to. Yeah. Uh, that turned? Mm hmm. About Engine quarter, turned? About a quarter turn. Yeah. Yep. That thing's going to start. Yeah, it good. almost started then. That's right. <clears throat> okay. My job is done. <laughs> All right. We'll see you guys later. Right. <laughs> it turned. Let me get up here and throw a block under it in case. It gets cray cray. So I'll be ready. Hold on okay. Because it is. It's about to. You... I'm just shocked it's not turned. It's not locked up. He took, took my ladder. Ah. <laughs> Go. Uh, I was trying to think of a Beach Boy song. Oh, that's, that's good too, Hank, right there. There's a disengage. We can not have the pumps turning. Oh, and okay. have hydraulic oil go everywhere. Fire it up. You got that off? Yeah. Hang on, let me let me check this pump. Uh, it's clutch back here. Do you want to uh Oh yeah, that's off. <laughs> Darn. Okay. I just, you know, what you gonna do if this sucker just starts right up? I'm gonna be like, yeah, this million view video. Share this video out. If we can get, let's see, if we can get fifty thousand likes on this video, then I will. I'm smoking up here, ain't? Is it smoking? Yeah. Are you serious? I'm trying to figure out something I'd do with fifty thousand likes, but how about uh, getting on it and see what you see? I don't know why it's smoking. It's not hot. <sighs> Nothing's hot up here. He probably kept cut the wire that kept it from smoking. <laughs> Hit that starter button and see if it'll spin now. Where'd you see smoke? I saw it from right here, but I mean, I got bad eyes. Right. Watch yourself. All right. It kind of hit harder, didn't it? Or I'm just. All right, hang on. again <laughs> did that thing not fire up i've never i i really am i'm always amazed when that happens dude that is awesome holy cow well fire it up one more time it's old fuel you quit telling me what to do <laughs> it's old fuel and it, it ain't locked up i mean it ain't uh it's aged fuel it ain't old yeah and it's not uh it ain't gonna run away that's crazy, ain't it, dude? <laughs> Twenty-five years. Oh I know boy. We're, I know we're kind of joking about it, but it's literally it's probably been twenty-five years. I'm not kidding. You know, when I said that, what are you gonna do if it starts right up? Yeah. I think I think they got the word. I think they got the word that Hank and Wiley was coming out, and he just gives up. You know what I mean? He's like, look, there's no no use of fighting it, man. These guys are gonna get me started. So. <laughs> That was awesome. Let's run it again. Let, let the hey, uh, of course, you can email Hank if the guy wants to sell it. But seriously, to all the buyers that may be interested in the engine, we, that's all we did to it was what you've seen. No kidding. It just started. 
So that would make a pretty good engine. I don't know if it'll run a little sawmill or not, but. Yeah, pretty awesome. It'll do something. All right, let's see, let's... see what the starter button will do if that done right. anything. Stupid starter button. That stupid starter button. Let's just listen to it purr for a minute. Real. In my excitement, I dropped the starter button. Oh, here, here it is. <laughs> I was getting out of there. Hey, that thing fired right up when I'm talking about, driver. All right, we can't, uh, I mean, it ain't hurting it because it's cool. I mean, because of the, you know, we don't have water in it. Yeah, the temperature is not bad. We'll let uh, it run for about a minute. Yeah, and just pull a lever in there when we do. One of those four levers, pull the one. Uh, second one to your left. Okay. That's the main boom. And it either lift up or it won't, but I doubt it will. But let's see if it'll do this again. Okay. Awesome. Hey, for you Detroit guys, why doesn't the three-cylinder have the emergency kill on the blower? Four cylinders do, but the three-cylinder right there does not have that emergency flap that kills the air going into the blower. Mm. I wonder why. And all these guys in the, the comments, I love it when you do that. Man, you're lucky that thing didn't run away. We are. <laughs> it's better well, to be lucky this, than this good. This time, I mean, we had had that ready to. Yeah, we had this ready. Kill some air, but it is pretty awesome. It really is. I felt good when the you know the governor box would turn that, too. Yeah, yeah, sure. Yeah, I, I felt good about it being able to cut it off. Is yeah. that what you're saying? Yeah, I got you. Ten full. This right here is what they call the I call it the dog leg boom. A lot of people didn't like them, but what it do, you put the, hit the butt of the log right there and it makes it heal faster than it does a regular boom. This was kind of like a putt wood grapple. And I'm sure that lever in there I told Hank might drive it was not. It, it had a slasher saw and they was cutting putt wood lengths out of this. And this thing being a little bit wider, when you grabbed it, it would keep, keep whatever you grabbed situated. But you can tell on the sawmill, he just had the front axle on there to keep it on the ground, it was probably mounted on a truck and the cab got tore off. And so he just tore the cab off and kept the, you see where the radiator brackets was right there. And he just kept it on the frame to move it around on the yard. But that's, uh, that's what that was called, a dog leg boom. All right, this is awesome. Wiley, you gotta help me unload this stuff, big dog. I, I can't. <laughs> That's, that's why I don't cook, Hank, because I have to clean up the mess. Yeah. That's why I let Dairy Queen do it. <laughs> this one's got a sharp point. Watch out. Well, come on. Look at you. Look at your, your cat-like reflexes. Yeah. <laughs> oh, boy. 
Don't, don't be my bar. Red, come on. Right. Yeah, that was pretty awesome. Where's Wiley? I'm, I'm just gonna throw these out. Yeah, here. please do. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't want to. You didn't want me to hurl them. No, at you, like you didn't have dart. to really throw them to me. You remember the lawn darts? Remember I, those growing up? I do. Up? I re I do remember that. You remember croquet? Uh, does like the mallet with the ball? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. That was so much fun, but I don't. Does anybody do that anymore? I'm not sure. I mean, we used to get in trouble when I beat my head and throw the balls at my brother, but <laughs> knock him in the head. <laughs> you used to hold your foot on one and whack it. All right. Had little things in the, what do you call them? Upside down horseshoes, but. Yeah. I got the bad end of this deal. <laughs> Where's your ladder at? I put the ladder right where you're standing. It makes it easier. You just get it right here. All right. I'd rather not be top, no more top heavier than I am. All right. Come Ready? On. Yeah. All right. I'll get the rest of it, old man. <laughs> I was hoping you'd say that. <laughs> Ugh. Ugh. I don't think people realize. I don't think people realize how difficult it is to basically do all this with one hand because you got to take care of the camera with the other. I don't think we realize how difficult it is for the people to watch. <laughs> <laughs> we think we give them, we don't give them enough credit for. Shoot, I got some of the best I don't know. in the world. I'm sure you're down to. 10% that started it right now. Hey, if you haven't subscribed, hit that subscribe button. We'd appreciate it. Hey, we got one more thing to show you. If you're hey, still... Before you don't forget, you got to put that back on. Okay. The yeah. engine's too good. That's a... Uh, um, we got one more thing to show you right quick before we button this up. So hopefully you, you made it this far into the video. But there's a tractor over here. And we think it's got a Deutz engine in it because we don't see a radiator. I think it's got ATCO um, markings on it, like badges and stuff. What is this? It's been painted green because you can see the paint runs there, but maybe it's a knockoff, but it's a four-wheel drive, front suspension. But y'all tell me, what does that look like? I want to say it looked like, maybe it's a, no, that looks like a, a mountain of some sort. I don't know, Wiley. But I'm pretty sure it's a Deutz engine. Because like I say, I don't see a radiator. Um, yeah, I don't see a radiator. What's that say? Inspected. But we've been trying to look for some clues and hadn't seen any. Why would they have a red marker on there? But this is a cool track. That is awesome, isn't it? It is awesome. Let me see if I can see anything on the other side. Did you figure out what kind it was? Did you figure out what made oh, it? Is it incoming? Incoming. Yeah, it's a Deutsch for sure. It's got air cool air fins on the side here. Did you figure out what make it is? No, I can't. That's why I'm looking for a badge or something. Fuel filter. I don't know. But uh, you're not stealing this thing. It's got a light switch right here for. My goodness, at all the levers. Yeah, that's crazy. That's not stopped up. So, uh, not stopped up, not stuck. Let me see. And he's got the exhaust covered right here, too. Yeah. I bet we can fire something that down. I bet so, too. Let's try it, don't you? Sure. I have no idea. It's just, that's nothing. 
Z uh, K K two A one 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 nine. It's just a casing stamp. <laughs> oh, here we go. I'm gonna get some brake cleaner. Uh, there's a plate on the side, but it just might be for the motor instead of the whole tractor. You know. I don't know. I have no idea. I have to. Oh wait a minute. Wait. A Belarus. That's it. It's a Belarus. Yeah. There you go. I Russia. Just, Made in Russia, right? B e l a r u s. Whatever the rest of. Made in Russia. Our comrades. Our comrades made that Belarus. You want to give it a shot? Uh, I wonder how you say yeah in Russian. <laughs> I asked a German friend of mine the other day, I said, can you answer this question for me? What is five plus four? And they said, nine. <laughs> oh, gosh. Okay. I think we're going to try to, we're going to try to fire that up. Say bye, Wiley. Bye, Wiley. <laughs> All right. You guys take care. God bless you guys. Check out this video right here. Remember, watch some more stuff from Hamiltonville Farm. We'd appreciate it. Take care. God bless.